I'd like to welcome you all to another Kali Tutors tutorial session. In this tutorial session, we'll be focusing on EUP 1501 assignment number two. If you are new to our YouTube channel, please subscribe to get access to the latest videos the moment that we upload them. Without wasting your time, let us look at what you're supposed to do in this assignment, okay? So, I hope you have watched the first uh, lesson where I demonstrated how to access your material. If you're not sure where to get the material, I advise you to look for the first video. I'll post the link uh, at the end of this uh, video, okay? So, this is what you're supposed to have after you've downloaded your material. So, your first file will be the file uh, with your name as part of its file name, okay? Uh, the second one, uh, this one, you're going to load this uh, through some steps, okay, when you're doing the assignment, okay? Uh, the third one is uh, your instructions file. So this is what you're supposed to open first. You're supposed to open the instructions file, uh, and then after doing that, you're supposed to open this one. So the one that has your student name is your working document. That is basically where you're supposed to do all the necessary work, okay? And to those of you who are new to Microsoft Word, to open a file, you simply double-click on it, okay? You see? Double-click. Okay. So, when you open the file that has your say name as part of its file name, uh, you will notice that it is actually blank. There is nothing. Uh, uh, it's not a mistake, okay? Nothing was deleted or something like that. It's supposed to be empty, okay? And uh, you are going to add information here as you go through the steps, okay? So let us look at step number one from the instructions file. So this is your instructions file. Uh, you're supposed to follow these steps here from 1 to 16, okay? So step number one says, uh, you need to open the word document, a student underscore word underscore one, e underscore photography underscore blah, blah, blah. Okay, this is basically the other file that I just opened, the one that is your, 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 your name is part of its file name, okay? We have already done that. So just highlight this. Uh, Okay, it's not a must that you highlight this. We're not going to submit this document. You are only going to submit the other document, okay? Uh, so after doing that, you move on to step number two. For step number two, they tell you that, okay, uh, type internship uh, available for photography assistant and then press enter. From your downloaded files, insert the text file word uh, underscore one e underscore assistant underscore uh, as dot docs okay so though the instruction tells us that we need to type this i actually advise you to copy okay instead of typing just highlight the text uh, then uh, right click to to get these options here and then click on select copy uh, after doing this go back to your working document okay and then you you left click and then you uh, right click to get options and then you paste this okay uh, I've already selected this icon here that is why you see that we have uh, something like a full stop here it's because of this icon here so I'm only using this uh, to show me if I've got extra spaces and stuff like that okay as you can see the space here is indicated in a form of a, a dot or something okay so I'd advise you to click on this icon here uh, so that you, you understand or you see if you've made uh, errors or you've included extra spaces that were not supposed to be there and stuff like that, okay? Just click on that, that icon, okay? And then after doing that, you, you will paste your text. And then after pasting your text, you'll click on enter. Then you're basically done with step number two, okay? Let's go back to the instructions and see if everything uh, has been done. No, we're not done. So they said after pressing enter, okay, uh, from your downloaded files, insert the text file word uh, underscore one e uh, assistant, blah, blah, blah. Okay, 
So to do this, let's go back to our working document. Uh, you will sub, you will click on insert. Okay, you will click on insert. Uh, then after clicking on insert, you will look for this uh, object here. Okay, then click on this icon here, the drop down menu, and then you will get two options: object or text from file. This is what we are looking for. We are, we are supposed to insert text from a file. Click on this one. Okay. It will give you options to select files. Okay. Look for the uh, documents that you had downloaded from uh, PS6. Okay. Mine are already on my desktop and under this folder here. So I'm going to search for that. And uh, yeah, after clicking on this uh, folder here, these are the files that I I found and we are looking for this document here click on it and then click on insert okay after clicking after clicking on insert you'll see the the text from that file will be loaded on your working document so now we are done with step number two uh, let us look at step number three